This ain't no custard. This is jail. Hi guys, in this video I'm going to be doing my first wash and go for this summer and I'm going to try a product combination to see how they play together. The first product is new to me and it is the Do Bee Girl Honey Curl Custard. I heard a lot about this product. I watched a few videos and I've heard very good things about it and then I heard some not so good things about it. So we're gonna we're gonna test it out today on my hair. And the product I'm going to pair it up with is one of my favorites, Camille Rose Honey Hydrate. Okay, so I already shampooed and deconditioned my hair and I had it wrapped up in a towel for about 15 minutes. So now it's time for me to apply my leave-in. And as always, I had my hair sectioned off because it's so much easier for me to work in sections. So I like to start in the back and split that section in half. And then I'm going to apply my leave-in. So first I'm going to wet my hair since it did dry a lot under that towel. And this spray bottle has hot water in there, but it comes out warm. And now I'm going to apply this Honey Hydrate. Y'all know I love this stuff. I might have put too much. Mm -mm. Love the way it smells, smells just like honey. It warms up when you rub it in your hands. And I'm going to apply it to this first back section. and just do a little detangling. Now the reason why I am going to use a leave-in before I apply the Do uh, Bee Girl Honey Custard is because I know my hair. If I just apply a custard or a gel on my hair without doing a leave-in first, it doesn't matter how much it claims to hydrate your hair, gels and whatnot, my hair is gonna, my hair is gonna dry out. So I always have to use a leave-in. And the Camille Rose usually works well with a lot of products, so that's why I'm gonna use it today. Okay, that first little section is done. One of the things I love about this Honey Hydrate leave-in is that the first ingredient listed is honey, and honey is a humectant. It helps to draw moisture from the air into your hair. So I especially love to use this in the summer when it's really humid out, because it keeps my hair hydrated. The next three ingredients listed are olive fruit oil, castor seed oil, and aloe leaf juice, all of which my hair loves. And it works really well when you mix it with other products. I don't get any flaking. I don't get any white residue. I tell y'all, I love this stuff. I hope they never stop making it because it will always be a staple in my hair regimen. Okay, I just finished applying the Camille Rose Honey Hydrate to all of my hair. And now I'm going to get ready to apply this uh, Bee Girl Custard from The Do. Okay, y'all, it's time to get this wash and go started. And we're going to be using The Do Bee Girl Honey Curl Custard. I'm so excited. Like I said, I heard some great things about this, but then there were some things that were not so great. And I think they were not so great because of the application. Some of the videos I saw, some people were really heavy handed with their application using this stuff. And I heard a little goes a very long way. So I'm a little nervous because I tend to be heavy handed uh, with my products. But yeah, some of them videos that I saw when they applied too much, they had some Gorilla Glue situations going on. And I ain't trying to do no Gorilla Glue situation. So I'm gonna try to be careful. This is my very first time using any product from The Do, so I wanna see what it's talking about here. Uh, what it do, 
that's cute. What it do? It hydrates, protects, and defines even the tightest curls with no crunch or flaky residue. What's good? These are the ingredients. Cationic honey, aloe, vitamins B, C, and E, keratin, and silk amino acids. So do you, these are the directions. It's cute how they do this. What it do, what's good, do you. And the directions say, apply to clean wet hair in small sections, rake through with fingers to clump curls, put dry or diffuse until 100% dry, fluff as desired. Okay, and once again, this is supposed to be a curl custard, not a gel, but I heard that it gives gel vibes, so we are gonna see. I also heard that it doesn't smell very good, and you know I'm a little disappointed about that, so we'll see. But anyway. Icky, sticky, icky. Woo. Okay. I don't want to spill it, but that's what it looks like. Very thick. She thick, thick. And she's very gooey. Okay. Now let's see how she smells. You know, I love stuff that smells good. be raining strawberries peaches watermelon no fruit smell whatsoever that I usually love this is very much this reminds me of okay I'm telling my age now but that slime that they used to sell back in the day that kids play with this smells like that green slime This ain't no custard. This is gel. Okay, got my first little section here, and I'm just going to spray it with this spray bottle because this is really going to get my hair soaking wet. sure how to describe it all I can say is it goes on very thick and it definitely coats those strands uh, well the roots and now I'm gonna apply some to these strands break it through wow Alright, so I put on my old school music so I can finish applying the custard to the rest of my hair. Y'all know how I do. Okay, y'all, I just finished applying the Honey Curl Custard, um, B-Girl Honey Curl Custard, and here are my wet results.
okay? So now I'm going to go sit under my hooded dryer until this is completely dry and then I will be back. All right guys, I am back and my hair is completely dry and do you see this definition? Just look at it. That's crazy, right? Y'all, my hair is so defined and it is a bit crunchy. It, we got crunch. So, I don't know what the dude was talking about when it said your hair wouldn't be crunchy because we got some crunch, okay? Let me show you the back. Okay, but you can see how much, look, the shrinkage, the shrinkage is real. So I'm gonna go ahead and stretch this out and then I'll be back. Okay guys, I just finished stretching my hair. If you are interested in seeing how I stretch my hair, I did do a video. I will link it in the cards above. Um, yeah, so now what I'm going to do, um, I'm not gonna oil my scalp just yet. I'll probably wait till tomorrow morning to do that. Um, but just stretching out my hair took away a lot of that crunch. Still has some crunch, but it is a bit softer. So now I'm going to get ready for bed because it is getting late and I am tired. So I am going to put my hair in my little satin pocket bonnet here. So I will see you all in the morning. Good night. Good morning. All right, I slept good. Let's see what this is looking like. All right, now I'm gonna take my oil mixture and just lightly oil my scalp. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of oil and squeeze it into my ends. All right, so now I'm just going to clean this up a little bit and make myself look a little more presentable and then I will be back in three two one all right guys this is the final look definition is crazy still mm. look at that feels very soft the crunch is just about gone now. I have just a little hint of crunch, but most of it is gone because I put the oil in my hair. And I fluffed it out just a little bit. But you know, each day is gonna get bigger and bigger, so I'm happy with how it looks right now. Let me show you the back. All right, guys, my final thoughts. These two products play very well together. My hair feels amazing. The definition is crazy. It feels soft. It feels moisturized. Everything that I need in my wash and goes. Now this right here, absolutely incredible. I will put this right up there with the pearly braid out blades from the main choice and even Uncle Funky's daughter. So I will be purchasing this again. This is gonna become one of my staples because it absolutely did a great job. And custard wear, I, I, this is a gel to me. This is not a custard, but if they wanna call it a custard, we're gonna call it a custard because it works really good. So whatever you wanna call it, long as it works, I'm happy. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and click that like button because it really helps out my channel. And if you like videos like this, 
and you're not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe and then click that notification bell so you don't miss another one of my uploads. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Bye.